2024 Mercedes-Benz GLS 450 First Test, Exploring Power and Elegance on the Road Each vehicle in the current Mercedes-Benz GLS lineup underwent modifications as part of the company's 2024 refresh, spanning from the premium Maybach and AMG models to the base-level GLS 450. The latter variant of this spacious luxury full-size three-row SUV now boasts an upgraded engine, alongside refreshed aesthetics and additional features. Pros. Cushy, refined ride. Excellent standard content and options. Good cargo space. Cons. Not as athletic as some rivals. High price. Other SUVs are more practical. The automotive category is filled with prominent contenders, notably from brands like BMW and Lincoln. With its recent updates, can the 2024 GLS 454 Matic base model now effectively compete with them? How swift is the six-cylinder variant? As anticipated, the least powerful GLS model takes the longest in the lineup to accelerate to 60 miles per hour, even with a 13-horsepower boost for 2024. Although we managed to trim 0.1 seconds off the automaker's estimated time of 5.6 seconds, the turbo straight-six mild hybrid still lags behind the more potent and pre-refresh V8 GLS 580, which achieves 4.7 seconds, and the AMG GLS 63 with a blistering 3.7 seconds. The recently updated inline-six BMW X7 is also in the same range, reaching 60 miles per hour in 4.8 seconds. A more suitable contender in terms of straight-line performance might be the more potent but heavier Lincoln Navigator, which is a couple of tenths slower to 60 miles per hour. However, all these large premium luxury SUVs exhibit sufficient urgency, alleviating concerns about overtaking or keeping pace with highway traffic. In sport mode, we even managed to make the tires chirp during some launches. The 2024 Mercedes-Benz GLS 450's engine and 9-speed automatic transmission consistently demonstrated responsiveness and poise. We use almost always ready, because the gearbox exhibited some unpredictability during our at-limit handling tests, occasionally following manual mode instructions and other times not. However, this behavior was limited to the track. In most situations, the transmission operated smoothly without any issues. Maneuvering the GLS Equipped with standard 4MATIC all-wheel drive, an air suspension with updated tuning, and optional summer tires, the GLS 450 proved to be an intriguing test subject. Despite its tall and heavy SUV build, the body movements were noticeable but composed. The vehicle exhibited excellent grip, although objectively not as superior as the 2023 X7 base model. In our lateral acceleration skid pad assessment, the BMW achieved an 0.88G average, outperforming our tested Mercedes by 0.03G, and completed our figure 8 test a full second quicker on our racetrack simulation. However, the 2024 Mercedes-Benz GLS 450 prioritizes comfort for its occupants. Our test vehicle did exhibit sensitivity to certain road surfaces, causing the cabin to resonate with tire noise on worn-out pavement stretches. Nevertheless, under normal conditions, the SUV delivered a plush ride. With the addition of the $1,100 Acoustic Comfort Package, featuring enhanced interior insulation and side windows with an acoustic finish, the cabin maintained a serene environment, akin to a library. Although lacking in feedback, the steering wheel exhibited pleasing weight and direct performance. The brake pedal, while uncommunicative and soft, offered easy modulation, and stopping distances from 60 miles per hour ranged from 106 to 111 feet, slightly surpassing the 2023 X7's best of 105 feet. In practical terms, the updated 2024 Mercedes-Benz GLS 450 narrows the efficiency gap with the X7 base model, achieving an additional 1 mile per gallon in both city and highway EPA estimated fuel economy compared to the 2023 GLS's 1823 MPG city slash highway rating. Although commendable within its class, the BMW maintains a challenging lead with its impressive 2125 MPG. Perceptions of spaciousness inside the GLS largely hinge on the chosen seating row. The first and third rows may feel somewhat confined for full-sized adults, the front due to the substantial center console and the rear because of what appears to be a low ceiling. 
However, the third row headroom surpasses the X7 by 2.3 inches, measuring 36.6 inches. Conversely, Artest GLS's second row felt expansive, attributed to the available captain's chairs, transforming this SUV into a six-seater. The inclusion of a massive standard panoramic roof further enhances the sense of roominess. Mercedes has optimized the cargo space in the GLS, outclassing its BMW counterpart. There's more space behind the second and first rows, measuring 48.7 and 84.7 cubic feet, respectively. Features such as a powered liftgate, power folding second and third row seats, and a convenient switch for a slight rear lowering contribute to the ease of loading and unloading the Mercedes. Living with it. There's no denying the anticipation of stepping into the GLS 450 every day, primarily for its escapist allure. Premium amenities include standard heated and ventilated front seats, a 13-speaker Burmester surround sound audio system, and multicolor ambient lighting. Our upscale family hauler came equipped with the $1,750 exclusive trim, featuring massaging front seats and heated rear seats. Adorned with standard weighty metallic switchgear and optional features like the $160 natural grain gray oak wood trim, $1,620 Bahia brown and black leather, a new colorway for 2024, and a crystal gray headliner, the GLS's cabin offers an exceptionally beautiful environment. The post-refresh GLS maintains a 12.3-inch gauge cluster screen, a same-sized central touchscreen, and a redundant center console touchpad, the latter of which may seem redundant. However, the latest version of Mercedes MBUX user interface performs seamlessly. The display is well-suited for the 360-degree camera system, a valuable feature for a luxury SUV of this size. The new flat-bottom steering wheel is a welcome addition. While the SUV's build quality showed a minor flaw with a panel on top of the steering column and a sticking pop-out module at the back of the center console housing the second row's USB ports. Though not objectively superior to its BMW rival in performance, the 2024 Mercedes-Benz GLS 450 remains an impressively capable and undeniably attractive full-size luxury SUV. It delivers ample power while sacrificing a bit of sportiness for comfort and refinement. Cargo space is generous, especially if rear rows aren't a priority. But above all, the GLS excels in providing an elevated passenger experience. Therefore, it is logical that the cost mirrors the high-end features. Our tested GLS is priced just under six figures, falling short by a couple of thousand dollars, $2,270 precisely, a figure that may give pause to some potential buyers. However, it's essential to note that optional add-ons contribute $7,800 to this total, with our preference leaning towards the acoustic comfort and exclusive equipment groups. Opting for these would bring the 2024 Mercedes-Benz GLS 450 to $92,780, closer to $90,000 than $100,000, yet still a substantial investment. While not everyone may find it within their budget, those who can afford it and appreciate the Mercedes-Benz aesthetic will likely appreciate how the base model offers a level of luxury akin to the top-tier models. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.